Andy Mogul. So the 83rd Academy Awards just wrapped and they really went out fabulously with the PS22 chorus singing Somewhere Over the Rainbow. To hear all those children's voices declaring dreams really do come true, with this year's Oscar winners standing behind them hoisting their trophies, truly brought a tear to the eye. And it was totally orchestrated, just like the entire show. With the exception of Tom Hooper winning for Best Director over David Fincher, there weren't any surprise wins. In fact, tonight's show was like a highlight reel of this year's entire award season, with everyone able to predict the winners a month in advance. Even the Tom Hooper upset wasn't that much of a surprise. So I'd like to remind the producers of the Academy Awards, and Hollywood in general, that movie magic only works when you don't see the strings. And we've been seeing them an awful lot these days. As for the show itself, my favorite acceptance speeches were given by Lee Unrich, who directed Toy Story 3, David Seidler, who wrote The King's Speech, and Randy Newman. I also liked the stage design this year quite a bit, and it was nice to be reminded of old Hollywood and that nobody hosts an award show quite like Bob Hope. However, Hollywood is doing great things today too, and I hope that next year the producers of the Academy Awards finally think of a way to highlight that as well. What did you think of the Oscars? Did you mind that there were no surprises? What did you like about the show, and what didn't you like? Write your thoughts down below, and I hope you'll check out all of Beyond the Trailer's Oscars 2011 coverage. Thank you.